Hello, I'm Peter Watkins. Today it's December the 22nd, 2003. I arrived here in Paris about a week ago to complete the editing of the abridged version of La Commune, which you're about to see. And I discovered for the first time that 13 productions, the French film company which produced La Commune with me in 1999, is directly involved with the French multinational corporation Le Gardaire. Now Le Gardaire is a vast empire, kind of huge spider's web, involving many French and international organizations via complex patterns of partnership, stocks and shares, ownership, uh, links, direct and indirect, direct with other companies and so on. But significant amongst the things produced by the companies working with Lagardère's capital are weapons of war, such as the armaments produced by Matre, the French arms company, uh, which include missiles. There is the Euro fighter plane and the Euro copter project. And 13 Productions is linked to these elements of the arms race via its involvement with Lagardère. Now, 13 Productions is certainly not alone in its links via Lagardère to the arms race. Uh, just to continue with the audiovisual sector in France, we find a number of other TV production companies and TV channels. In the print media, we find direct links between Lagardère and the French newspaper Le Monde, and the newspaper Le Humanity, the official organ of the French Communist Party. The concentration of Lagardère's ownership is perhaps worst in the French print media sector, involving many, many magazines, uh, newspapers and publishing houses, including Hachette, which produces textbooks for schools. The implications for today's society of vast and obscure financial networks, such as those of Lagardère and other multinational corporations, are absolutely horrendous, especially because all this is happening with a complete lack of transparency. How can we claim to live in a democracy? How can we even talk about practicing genuine citizenship? if we have no idea what is being done in our name, if we have no idea of the links between us as individuals and the organizations we work for, and the multinational corporations responsible for the arms race and all the other things that they are involved in. Now I have to emphasize that Tres production gave me every liberty to make La Commune. Uh, 13 Productions put no pressure on me whatsoever, either during the filming or the editing of the original long version or this abridged version. But I have to say that I find it very wrong and contradictory for a French film production company involved as it is in communications and in the process of education to be sharing a financial structure which involves the arms race. And I find this particularly inappropriate for a company which has produced a film on the Paris Commune of 1871. Thousands of communards died for their beliefs in 1871. We hope that before you've reached the end of this film, you will see how and why the questions facing the communards are very similar to the questions facing us today.